Oh hi! Thanks for watching my video, and welcome back to another ranch episode. So, we have a couple of days until the Finchwick Fair, which is on Saturday. So my main objective for today, really, is to try and get in the best position possible to win. We'll do a few little side activities as well. Probably gonna get some chickens today. We might try and befriend Patchy so he can take care of my garden. I think first things first. Oh, you're giving Jeff a cuddle. Oh, bless. First things first, let's go over to Finchwick and see if we can get some ingredients. See what they've got, see what we can bake into a pie. I did also have a look through my um, wine racks to see what the situation was. And I have 16 bottles of finely aged wine, um, which I'm gonna sell in my little shop, which probably in the next episode will open a little farm shop. I do have four bottles of nectar that I made in the last episode. So given that I'm gonna sell all 16 bottles, probably it would be a good idea to start working on rebuilding the other 12 just to make sure I can restock my wine rack. Just so that we always have a constant flow of wine aging, just to make sure there aren't any restocking issues in the shop, you know? And yeah, like I said, we'll get some chickens. Maybe we'll test out a few different things with different treats because we could sell some of the eggs in the shop. I'd also like to work on my cooking skill in this episode because right now we're cooking level eight, but it would be perfect if we could be like level nine or 10 when we enter the competition. And I'm really hoping I can find some chocolate. Oh, here we go, chocoberry, brilliant. I'm gonna get both of those in case I fuck it up. Should I get anything else? Mm, I think that will do for now. Oh, and maybe I will check farm. out the crumple bottom <laughs> stool. I can't, remember what, I can't remember where you get animal treats. It's been so long since I played with any of that. I can't remember if I have to make it myself or if I can buy them. Okay, party treat. All right, we'll, we'll get one of those. Do you know what, actually? I might pick up some fruits that I don't have yet just so I can, like, increase the amount of produce I can make. So I'm going to get some blackberries. I'm going to get some blueberries because I want to start making jam as well for the shop. We'll get a cherry tree. You know what? I might even plant my own chocoberry. Raspberries. I don't think I've got a raspberry bush yet. Oh, there's actually a load of stuff I can get from here. I'm gonna do a lot of planting. In terms of treats though, there isn't really that much. Okay, well I've got 28 items. So let's go home and see what we can do with that. I might need to extend my little, my new greenhouse. Okay, so let's um, get some chickens in. I'm not really too worried about breeding, so I think I'll just go for some hens. Or maybe I'll get six hens and two roosters so that they can breed if I need them to. Hey guys, hey, welcome to the family. Scatter some feed nearby. I'm gonna give the treats to the hens. So black hen, you can have party treat. White hen, you can have a fishy treat. Come on ladies, come on out, come on, don't be shy. Oh, the sheep is in love with the chickens. Oh, you need a little bit of a clean, don't you? And then brown hen, you can have a veggie treat. Where are my other small animals? How are they doing? Are they dirty or anything? Black goat's fine. This one's fine. Okay, where's my white goat? Here we are. Okay, we'll come clean you up. Oh, grab some of that manure for my shop. Okay, so I'm gonna hop into build and buy and just I think we might just need to extend this a little bit, this greenhouse. She says a little bit, ends up making it like over double the size. Okay, perfect, we've got our greenhouse extension. So, what are we gonna plant? Oh, roses, definitely need to plant roses. Cause we're doing bouquet making as well. So that's why I thought to get some flowers too. Some snapdragon, okay, so we've got a good range of flowers growing. Some of these, oh, maybe a flutterberry, that'd be nice. Gonna plant two of these choco berries. Pomegranate, raspberry, blackberries. Okay, is there anything else I haven't planted yet? Maybe this mushroom. Okay, I think everything else I've got growing. All right, cool, this place is gonna look beautiful when everything's all growing and sprouted. Let me, I'm gonna send the girls for some training. Tulip can do, uh, let's do jumping. And then my little pumpkin, maybe she could do temperament. Okay, perfect. Horses out of my hair, doing a bit of training. Don't just stand there, keep planting, girl, keep planting. 
Okay, so every, I think everything's been planted now. Okay, cool. Brilliant, brilliant. I mean, it's not the most organised thing, but I can put them in neat little lines in a bit. Oh, some more uh, horse manure for me. Well, I think maybe let's make, because we've got a lot of wine to make, 12 bottles. So let's go and clean that nectar maker and see if we can make a bit more nectar. We have all this stuff to harvest as well. So much on our plate, man. So much on our plate. All right, let's do, um, hmm, maybe four bottles of nectar? We'll do four bottles of energy nectar. Although, how's that needs? Oh, those needs are fine. Yeah, we'll do four. So I really wanted oh, to do the pie competition. I want to try and win the pie competition. Oh. It, it is also the garden fair, so you can put in Gosh, something uh. that you've grown. I wasn't really going to bother with that, but actually, I think some of the flowers I have... The Dahlia and the Begonia, I think they're quite uncommon. And I do have a Dahlia that's excellent quality. It probably won't win, but there's no harm in submitting it. So I'll probably just enter both competitions on Saturday. Two days left of autumn before we come into winter. Great source of income having so many plants. The only thing is I do have to keep an eye on them every day because so often they're like ready to evolve. So I'm having to keep my eyes peeled for that like every day pretty much. Getting a bit hungry. Okay, that's quite good. I'm glad you're hungry because we can work on your cooking skill. Maybe once you finish all that, we will we'll cook something, maybe something a little bit more complicated. Let's do gumbo. Hopefully that will help us raise our cooking skill a bit quicker. All right, four bottles of nectar, done. So we just need eight more bottles. Oh, I should probably try and work on my uh, canning skill as well. I can make chocolate syrup. I just wanna be in a position where I've got a little shop and I can sell everything that is homegrown on the ranch. Grab a serving, where's my man? Grab a serving. Where are you, where have you been? Just sticking about in the, in the greenhouse. Oh, some of these already starting to grow. Some of them even need evolving already. I might just have Dev come over here and just water all of these plants. How's Tulip's skills coming along? Oh, pretty good. She did well with her jumping today. Okay, cool, cool. Maybe we will take a shit, take a shower. Just stick this in the fridge. And then we will practice canning. We'll do a meat substitute, mushroom. I like how that says any milk, yet it won't accept goat's milk. I guess maybe I need to get some sugar because I've got plenty of apples so I could make that and I could make strawberry jam as well. So which one are we making now? Meat substitute. Okay, great, great. What kind of quality is that? Excellent quality. Okay, great. Oh no, I think the dog is sick. Dev, you're going to have to get up. You've got to take the dog to the clinic. Uh-oh, white mini sheep isn't happy. Ah, oh, shit, man. I was hoping to get a few hours sleep tonight. Okay, Dev, quickly, let's just go to the poor hospital. We don't have long to spend here, so um, sign him in. Sign him in to cure his sickness. Make it snappy. Oh, okay, perfect. We know what's wrong with him. He's got derpy doggy syndrome. Let's just go for the treatment. Oh, oh, all the best. The best that money can buy. Just get him fixed so we can get him home. Good boy, Jeff. Okay, back home with a healthy dog. Okay, we're still working on our canning. I think we'll do... Oh, Tulip's sleeping. Maybe I'll let her rest for a little bit and then I'll send her for... Or maybe we could do a quick competition. We've got time to do a competition today. A fire has started. Where? Where's the fire? Oh, shit. Is it the fireplace? Extinguish the fire. Wait, I don't really understand what it is that's actually caught on fire. It's the roof, I guess. How's anyone meant to reach that? Okay, you know what, Alyssa? I'm gonna have to have you stop doing that and then, um... Call the fire department. I guess it must be the fireplace. Yeah, he's extinguished it. Oh, well done, Dev. Well done. Protecting your family, keeping us safe. Well done. Okay, I'm gonna take this opportunity to harvest everything I've got outside because we're almost at the end of the season. Pretty soon I won't have access to all of these flowers or my mushrooms. So we are just gonna come and harvest everything. Oh, this apple tree is perfect quality. Okay, I think we've evolved, I think we've harvested everything, haven't we? Yeah, okay, right. Let's take the girls out to the equestrian centre, just to bring in a few thousand simoleons. Okay, I think everyone's happy. Enter competition. We will do tulip first. So I think we're going to do the master at this one. We didn't get gold last time. We still might not, because we still don't have level 9 in jumping. But you know what? We're just going to go for it. Oh, gold place. Well done, tulip. 
Okay, let's see what Pumpkin can do. I don't think she qualifies for any expert levels still, but that's okay. We'll do um, we'll do endurance because she got bronze on that one last time. Another gold medal. That's my girls. Okay, maybe they'll be up for a bit of training when we get back. Maybe I'll send them off for training. I want to get Tulip working on her uh, jumping. Is there another fucking fire? Well, the game seems to think there's a fire, but it doesn't look like there is. Okay, whatever. So Tulip can do jumping. Pumpkin, you can do your temperament again. And then I did say I wanted us to work on our cooking skill. Oh, but you know what? I'm also, I think I'm going to head to Henford on Bagley and get a load of, um, let's sample some of the food at the Spice Festival. No, I want to go to Henford on Bagley so I can buy a load of sugar. So I can make more different types of canned goods and build up my cooking skill. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Well, I might get some milk because then I might be able to make, um, custard jars. Oh, I might plant a pineapple. Loads of sugar. I think that will do. Okay, so Alyssa, I am just gonna have you do a load of canning. Do apple jar, raspberry, blackberry. We'll do strawberry as well. Is that everything? Oh, I need an egg to do custard. Oh, that's fine, I can go get an egg in a bit. In fact, I might get Dev to do a few little jobs for me. Scatter feed nearby, collect the eggs. How many eggs have we got in there? Five. Um, also, Dev, I'm gonna have you clean the coop. How are my newly planted flowers getting on? I mean, they're sprouting. That's something. Get in there. Loads of evolutions going on over there. What else can I have Dev do that would make him useful? Sheep is fine. Goat is fine. Oh, you jamming two things at once. Check you out. Okay, and we have one last tray here, strawberry jam. And then we've done all of our jamming for the day, Alyssa. And then if you want, you can get leftovers and have some food. Okay, so big day tomorrow. What time does it actually start? 3.30 p.m. Okay, so we still have time tomorrow morning to get some stuff done. Did Dev collect those uh, those eggs like I asked him to? Oh yeah, we've even got a blue egg. Okay, I'm just gonna stick them out here for a second. I have one hatchable egg here, so I'm gonna incubate it. It probably won't hatch because I already have the maximum amount of chickens, but you never know. Right, I think, I think now we need to get a good night's sleep. And maybe we'll have a cheeky woohoo as well to try and sort out your relationship, to try and bring you guys a bit closer together. Dev, go to bed, just go to bed. Ah, oh, peaceful day. Some kind of activity going on in the sky, it seems. All right, I think all my chickens are hungry, so Dev, you better wake up. Let's put you to work. Scatter the feed nearby. How's our hatch? Slightly dirty hutch. You can clean the coop. And then you can grab leftovers for yourself. You know what, Alyssa? I might just have you make some custard if you can. Oh, we can make mayonnaise and custard. Right, make both of those. And then we'll have like a good range of jarred or canned goods to offer our customers. Okay, is everyone doing okay? Everyone clean and fed in terms of my little animals? Yeah, everyone's good. Great. Well, what I might do is take this time to craft some nectar. Let's do um, fruit nectar. And also, you know what, Dev, also, what's his skill level? He's level four nectar making, so I might get him to make some nectar while I focus on baking a pie. So Dev, you can make... Just make like four bottles of strawberry nectar, will you? Oh, don't let that fear of failure get the most of you, Alyssa. Look at your life. You're doing so well. Well, I think it might be baking time. I don't know why. I feel kind of nervous, actually. I just really don't want to lose. We didn't manage to increase our skill any higher than level eight. Oh, we could do apple pie. We could do apple pie. This whole time I was thinking we could do chocolate. But you only need to be cooking level five to do chocolate pie. Apple pie, you need to be skill level eight. I would have thought that would give us a better chance. You know what I'm gonna do, actually? I'm gonna make my own dough first. Some dough. That way, um, I'm using hopefully only excellent quality apples and dough that I've made myself. In fact, you know what? I reckon I've got magnificent quality apples in here. Perfect quality. The only thing is, how do I make sure that um, the one we use is the perfect quality one? I've got nearly two grams worth of apples in my inventory. How do I make sure that we definitely use the perfect quality one? Oh, I'm just gonna have to hope for the best. Oh yeah, I got some more um, tulip. Get out of there. Get out of the other greenhouse. Um, 
what does this grow in? Summer and spring, so it's not going to grow for a while. I might put my pineapple somewhere for Dev to plant. Where are you going? You're supposed to... Did you make the dough? Still mixing. Okay, th well, only three minutes until it's ready, though, so get your ass over here so we are ready to go. Excellent quality. Okay, okay. Right, so this should be top quality pie. That's right, okay. Cook. Apple pie. Please use the perfect quality apples. I can't be asked to take them all out and only put the perfect quality ones in. Oh, oh, okay, wait, <laughs> what's the verdict? What quality is it? Normal quality? Oh, no. Okay, make some more dough. Fucking hell. Right, I'm gonna sell all of these apples. I've still got loads left. Okay, and then once you make the dough, you are gonna take a thoughtful shower. Let's get you inspired. This fucking pie, just stick it in the fridge. Useless to me now. Take a thoughtful shower, get inspired. So now you only have perfect quality apples in your inventory. Oh, now she's uncomfortable. Well, she's that's going to expire in a second. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to buy, because I've got quite a lot of reward points. Let's see, have I got inspired here? Inspired potion, only 200 points. This fair is happening any minute now. Drink your inspired potion right now. Go on, girl, get it down you, get inspired. Drink, drink, and now, now we're gonna make apple pie with perfect quality apples and hopefully excellent quality dough. I'm assuming the dough we made is excellent quality. Okay, so let's try and do a better quality pie now. Let's, not normal, not normal. Okay, it's sparkling, excellent quality, oh yeah, okay. Perfect. Right, well, Finchwick Fair. Oh, it starts at 3.30, not 2.30. Oh, for some reason I got confused. All right, go on then, go have some breakfast. And then you can take a shit after and then we will be good to go. Or just eat your breakfast while sat on the throne. Okay, let's go. Travel to Finchwick Fair, hopefully we win some ribbons. I'm not too confident about the gardening thing, um, just to submit one of my flowers, but you know, I think possibly with the pie, Good chance to hang around with the locals as well, make a few friends. Right, so I think this is where we put in our pies. Submit entry. Don't know who that bitch thinks she is. Okay, excellent quality apple pie. Very nice, very nice. Excited Ooh, competitor. Yeah, that pie looks good. Okay, now what can we, what can we submit to this one? Submit entry. Right, we're not gonna do a grape. I think a flower is probably the way to go. Is that the highest I've got? Excellent. I don't have anything magnificent. Okay, I think excellent is the highest I have, so I'm just gonna have to do an excellent Dahlia and see where that gets me, if anywhere. There she is, my beautiful flower. Compliment her fair entry, but compliment it sarcastically. Well, I'm pretty sure this event goes on for quite a while, so I may as well introduce myself to a few of these sims. Oh, there's Cindy! She's the sim that looks after every animal, except bees, because we forgot bees. Oh yeah, I'm gonna talk to her. I wanna be her friend. What did she enter? Is this her one? A fruit pie, normal quality. <laughs> oh, well, you know, at least you showed up. It's not the winning that counts, Cindy. For some reason, the game doesn't seem to recognize that I have already introduced myself to Cindy like five times, and it just keeps telling me to introduce myself. Ask about day. I didn't even put that outfit together for her, but together for her, but she actually looks quite cute, doesn't she? Bless her. She lives the farm life. I live the farm life. She's an animal enthusiast. So are we, kinda. Are we an animal enthusiast? Yes, we are. We're an animal enthusiast. Oh, we gotta get Juniper in on this. We could be like a little gang, little gang of friends. If you hear um, any background noise, that would be the rain pouring from the sky right now. Fabulous British weather. Oh, we're basically best friends already. When's the judging gonna begin? Finishes at 9.30, okay. So the judging should be done soon. Right, once again, I'm just gonna come check over the competition. So in terms of the pie competition, it's only me and Cindy competing. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna beat her. And then in terms of the, like, crops, normal quality bell pepper, really? You think you're gonna win with that? <laughs> These chumps, man. What about this strawberry, normal quality strawberry as well? And here is my excellent quality Dahlia. Not normal, not nice, excellent. You know what, we might just be bringing home two badges tonight. I don't know why they're having a offensive conversation. Oh, that guy seems quite nice, he could be my backup plan. 
What's his name? Oh, Salim Banali. Oh, he scrubs up all right. Yes, we like pet enthusiasts. Yes, we do. Oh, it's already nine o'clock. We've got to get a verdict soon, surely. Where's the judge? Attempt to bribe judge. Um, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go do a respectful, respectful introduction. Make a good impression, you know. Howdy, judge. The event will end in an hour. All right, well, when will I find out if I won, though? I didn't do all of this to not find out if I... Okay, okay, okay. I think Mrs. Judge is going round doing her job for f for once. Finally. That's right. That's right. Write it down. Normal quality, that is. So, she doesn't seem too impressed to me. Thumbs down. Okay. And now she's just walked away. I guess she's giving up on the judging. I guess she's done judging now. Is she just not going to do it? We're not going to have any winners, huh? I'm going to be so pissed off if this just breaks and we don't have a winner because the, the mayor's fucking running away. I see her over there, legging for it. For fuck's sake! The competition's over, everything's disappeared. So not only have I lost my excellent quality... Oh, hang on, hang on. Finchwick competition. Congratulations, your plant won first place at the Finchwick Fair. Check your Sims inventory to find your plant. Okay. What about the... um? First place garden competition. Yeah, okay, okay. Did I not win the pie one, though? So, I guess she didn't judge the pies. Well, I'm glad I entered something, because we wouldn't <laughs> we wouldn't have known whether we placed or not. So I have no idea if we won the pie competition. I'm going to assume that I didn't. But we did win the plant one, so that's something, I guess. Well, on that note, I think I'm going to end this episode here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.